Hey guys and welcome back to a new Dragon City video. Now if you may or may not have already noticed, my high spike Randadillo is fully empowered at level 61. So I have enough food to level him up a couple of levels, like four or five levels, but I've trying to I've been trying to stack up some food for upcoming events, so I'm not gonna take him to level 70 for now. Since I already maxed him and I don't need his jokers for anything apart from trading, I guess this is the only right thing to do if I already maxed him. So with level 61, I can complete the entire quest. I haven't completed it since I just empowered him a couple seconds ago, but I guess it is time to claim this 500 orbs of high spike trinadillo and more importantly the azura skill skin so by simply owning the skin your dragon will deal boosted damage for its impaling inferno skill and ice attack please restart your game for this to take effect so let's close this right now click the claim button and this is what I've been working towards. So the Azure skill skin and 500 orbs of high spike Radadillo. Let's click claim. And then you can see those 500, or, I mean 550. I, I got the 50 from the quest, but no one probably cares. So 550 orbs of high spike Radadillo. Comment down below if you want these orbs. But more importantly, the Azure skill skin. So here I have the Amber skill skin equipped. This is a, the adult skill skin. As you can see, it is significantly smaller than the original skin, which I don't really appreciate because I like big dragons. So the Azure skill skin does look good. It's probably the best skin out of these, but the only downside is of course the size. And I don't mean that in a weird way. But uh, let's equip the skin and I will do some testing. I'll just wait for uh, the... I'll just restart my game for this to take effect and I'll see you in a couple of minutes. So I restarted my game and as you can see there is a difference in the attacks. So from Impaling Inferno which I believe is a 2400 power is now Impaling End to 2750 power. Now from, Icic uh, from Icicle Spear I think to Icicle Crush and uh, we can do Icicle Drop Plus or Lethal Lance, I think. Yeah, Lethal Lance Plus. If we train this dragon, uh, I probably won't be doing that yet. But let's test out this dragon in the arenas. So we have three battles here. I'll we'll replace Hazaz with Mr. High Spectrum and Double Dragon and hope for the best. Okay, they get the first hit, that's completely fine. We have a, okay. Oh, he dodges and let's get our Gamma Shield up. This is what I like about Gamma Guard. He uh, negates the damage, which is quite nice. I don't mean negate, I uh, just block some of the damage. Let's take this guy out with Norn and then and then let's see how strong is this impaling end attack. The the damage I would say is quite significant from around uh 100 yeah, from around 100,000 to around 1 1 uh 1400 yeah. Yeah, so uh plus 40k damage is of course quite good. Next we'll try the Icicle Spear move, uh, ooh, this would be quite good, I'll just do that first, uh, will I kill him, uh, hopefully I won't kill him, okay, and then we can get a massive hit out of this, oh my god, that, that is so much damage, that is also so much damage, we'll just, use our shield for this I guess like he heals anyways and we can counter with a critical attack do a rebound and we'll take him out with 
Rhinodillo. Okay, last arena battle here. Hmm. Let's go for Gamma Guard right off the bat. And then we can do Impaling End. And Icicle Crush and then the Reaper should take him out. And then Frag, Frag should come out, I believe. Okay, it's Frag. Uh, I still have the shield, so I guess I'll make the most use out of Ryan Dillo. Now he's gonna hit us back with a crit. Just counter with Gamma, Iron Shaw. Okay, we'll kill himself and then we'll take him out with the Reaper perk. Like, I swear to god, the Reaper perk with High Spike Renardillo is such a nasty combo. Okay, Risen Iron Shock. Oh, he revives Gamma, that's completely fine. We still have uh, Norn on the Reaper, and we can take Ambition out with uh, our Reaper perk. Okay, so quite nice there. The damage is quite significant from before. So I am quite impressed. I might actually max this dragon unlike some of my other heroic VIPs, let's just say. But my my next pr priority is probably going to be High Voodoo Vampire or Arcana Fool. Comment down below which one you prefer and we'll do a couple of league battles before we go I guess. Okay, so... You can... Change your team, let's just... We're probably gonna beat everyone anyways, so... Oops, we'll click OK. So let's see what this first guy has got. Let's try Icicle Crush, why not? And this is gonna be fun. A Skeletal Extractor. Now, if you haven't watched my other video about the new Extractor Hero VIP, it's probably the video before this. It's the video about the uh, leaks and stuff uh, coming in the couple of months. Uh, there is a segment in there talking about uh, the news. Uh, what's it called? The, the new Extractor Hero VIP. My apologies. Oops. Okay, we have. A big extractor here. Take him out with icicle crush. Oh, 420 health. Impaling end. Like this dragon is so fun to play with the impaling uh shelter end uh I have no idea what to call it at this point, but the shield skill of these spikes is so fun to play with. And let's just do our last leak battle. Like here, like, it's just so good. Like, the damage, already with the damage increase, you have the shield. They're taking even more damage. And if they accidentally, uh, you know, kill themselves, uh, and, they have a fe and they have a phoenix perk, the reaper could just double up. It's just so menacing and absolutely annoying to go up against. Uh, let's see if I have any more Reaper perks. I don't have any more Reaper perks because I'm poor. But I'll probably release some other t new testing videos with this dragon. But for now, uh, I think he is quite a good dragon. The skill definitely gives him a decent power up. So if you do enjoy this video, please uh, like and subscribe. Uh, it's a very nice way to support the channel and the things I do on this channel. So if you do enjoy, please uh, check out my other videos, like, subscribe, show some support, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you very much for watching.